Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Happy Cat in Crypto here. So let's dive into a Terra Station update and a few more things that have been um, developing across the board and uh, really just get you up to par um, as to everything that's happening. So let's dive straight into it. As you can see, I have got the governance up and it's working fine again. Um, it seems that TFL fixed this issue. We have a statement made from the chairman of the board and that is the issue with the Terra Station website has been resolved by TFL. Following the PR and issue report that was submitted to them yesterday and Terra Station is operating normally again. And this is really good news to see that TFL came out and fixed this problem. Because at the end of the day, Terra Rebels would have only have fixed it. So it kind of <clears throat> shows everybody else and validators on board and the communities that... Um, it is important that they do step in and they do fix things. And in my opinion, it's quite a good sign seeing them uh, an issue become created from a code change on the main net and that code implementation have a issue uh, with the classic side of everything. And then in turn, the classic net going down, the main net staying up and them actually putting um, themselves forward and fixing it. That's not to say they're doing loads and loads of work. It just means that they heard us, in my opinion. An issue came up. We made a lot of noise about it between everybody at Terra Rebels and myself here at Happy Catty Crypto. And we made a lot of noise. So um, as to this proposal, it has passed. I can show you it properly on my screen now. Um, and we had 43 uh, validators vote yes. And there was 59 validators that did not vote. We had five that abstained and uh, Orion Money didn't vote. And now I know a lot of people have uh, found themselves uh, obsessed and um, fixed on the fact that Orion Money should have voted. And this is just not the case all the time, folks. We can't please everybody um, at the end of the day. As to why they didn't vote about getting staking and delegation put back in place, we don't know. But hopefully we'll find out soon. Um, today there's going to be a live stream later on today in the evening um it'll probably be yeah well it's going to be around nine o'clock this evening and i'll be streaming the orbital command um terra classic future meeting uh live on youtube to all you folks i'm hoping that we're going to get a position and be able to talk um to someone there and actually bring forward all of the um things that are unfolding and transpiring within the community and it's very important that <clears throat> we attend this meeting because for one, it's public. Anybody can attend. I'm hoping it's going to be a, like the Discord calls where you can raise your hand and you get provided speak power. And um, yeah, it would just be really nice to hear a pretty much official statement come from someone who is so well connected with Terra Labs, Duquan, and uh, yeah, TFL in general. Um, so yeah, it's very important. If you are about this evening and you do feel like tuning in, we will be streaming that live and I'll be doing a voiceover commentary on top of everything that is being said. And then also in the chance and hope that we do get chosen to speak. Um, another thing I wanted to add in this morning, uh, sorry, this afternoon on this video is what is happening with the Telegram group. And um, we're having a bit of an issue pretty much with uh, misinformation inside the Telegram group. Uh, people who are in the Telegram uh, chat group that don't watch the content, um, they constantly FUD. They post questions and a lot of other things which have already been unanswered and it's just got to a point of where it's out of control. Um, people are saying they're being banned for all sorts of crazy reasons and when a group gets so big like that, it becomes to a point of there's just so much chat going through um, the Telegram group all the time. It's I'm never there. That's why I have moderators to moderate it. But it's got to a point now of where people are literally just complaining about being banned. And then when we go back to look at it, it seems they have been banned for a, a genuine reason of being rude to members, uh, being rude about Happy Catty Crypto, um, fudding, constantly being negative and things like that. And uh, yeah, so what my choice is today, and it's it's a hard choice and I didn't really want to do this, is to actually shut this Telegram group down. So what will be happening is 24 hours from now, I'll be shutting down the Telegram group chat, not the broadcaster, 
just the group chat okay folks so if you still want the updates you still want all the good stuff all of the actual things that we got the telegram group there for there will still remain the broadcasting system and i've noticed that we had 1200 people in the chat but we only had 400 people on the broadcaster and it made me think straight away right this is obviously something that needs addressing we need to sort this out do people really need to be talking in a happy cat crypto group chat no they don't um, we've had a lot of issues with people making themselves seem like they're part of my team, um, in the mod, uh, group chat and to put it bluntly to everybody and <clears throat> without sounding like a complete and an idiot, um, it's just me and my cat. It's just me and my cat that do everything, um, to do with the happy cat crypto channel with the content and everything like that. Yeah. I had six moderators that run the group chat, but like I said, in two, in 24 hours from now, that group chat will disappear. I've frozen the messages in it, so no one's allowed to message. So if you are in there, you want to carry on getting the updates, you want to carry on staying in the uh, know, then just join the broadcast system. That's what it's there for. We really don't need a group chat. Um, if you feel like you need somewhere to chat, head over to the Lunatics Discord um, or head over to Terror Rebels. And uh, yeah, you can jump in there, have a chat with some uh, like-minded people and um, ask questions there. So yeah, folks, that's really all I've got for you for now. Um, do remember that the Terra Station coming back online is such a huge thing. It really is huge. And uh, yeah, stay safe out there. Beware of scammers, doppelgangers, anybody pretending to be me, anybody giving WhatsApp numbers out. That's not me. And uh, yeah, catch you folks in the next one. Shloop.